It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what Mr. Rubble has in store today. Wow, they're building a crazy golf course. They're almost done in no time. Diggly and Daisy are putting in the finishing touches. Great, the windmill is in place. Now it's time to test it out. Mr. Rubble is going first. He's taking it very seriously. He hits the ball. It rolls over the hills. Loops the loop. Goes round the roundabout. Through the pipe. And... Hang on. Where is the ball gone? Aha! There it is. That's not right. It's gone off the course. Diggly hits the ball back up the chute. He's plugging the pipe with a cork to stop it from happening again. Very clever, Diggly. But where's it gone? Ouch! Watch out, Mr. Rubble. Mr. Rubble hits the ball around the bend. Now the windmill, but it's spinning way too fast. Watch out, everyone. Hmm, maybe they should change the speed of the windmill. There, that's better. Mr. Rubble tries again. And it's straight through and in the hole. Nice work, Mr. Rubble. It's Diggly's turn. The ball goes over the hills, loops the loop, round the roundabout, through the pipe, under the windmill. Wow, it's a hole in one. Now it's Daisy's turn. Whoa, slow down, Daisy. The ball bounces off the rock and hits Mr. Rubble. It bounces off the windmill and it lands in the hole. Hooray for Daisy. The whole construction crew are getting ready for today's job. <laughs> They're building that crumbly old building. Uh -huh. That can't be right. Mm. Oh, they're demolishing the building. Daisy is so excited. Soon enough, it's time to get to work. The building looks like it could fall down any moment. It'll be safer to knock it down. Uh. Everyone is ready to get started. But wait, stop everyone. There's a little kitten beside it. Oh no, the kitten could get hurt if they knock it down now. Phew, Diggly stopped them just in time. They need to get the kitten out of harm's way. She's so cute. Ooh, I think Mr. Rubble's afraid of cats. The kitten ran back inside. Oh dear. They can't knock down the building with the kitten inside. Diggly's trying to get her to come out with some milk. Daisy wants to pet the kitten, but Diggly thinks that will frighten her. Oh no, Daisy accidentally hit the building. I think it's going to collapse, but the cat is still inside. What will they do? Maybe Mr. Rubble can help, but he'll have to face his fear of cats. <gasps> Mr. Rubble is small enough to fit inside. Phew, Mr. Rubble saved the kitten. And just in time, that was a close one. Mr. Rubble was very brave to rescue the kitten. I think he's got over his fear of cats now. He's made a friend. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ. And everyone's excited to start work. But Mr. Rubble looks so tired. Oops, Daisy didn't mean to knock over all the plans. There, today's plans. But something's wrong. That playhouse doesn't look right. Oh well. If that's what the plans say, that's what they'll build. Now everyone's hard at work. But oh dear, 
Mr. Rubble is so mm -hmm. sleepy. Surely no one will notice if he has a short nap. But Diggly can't figure this out. Something is definitely wrong with these plans. But what is it? There. The playhouse is nearly finished. They just need a few finishing touches. But oh no! It doesn't stand up properly. This isn't right at all. Here's Mrs. Skip. Looks like she's trying to say something. Hmm, that sign can spin upside down. That's it. The playhouse plans are upside down. That's why it looks all wrong. Now there's just one thing left to do. Three, two, one, jump! There. That woke Mr. Rubble up. But the playhouse is the right way up now. Good job, everyone. Hey, look. It's all the construction vehicles. Looks like they're repairing the road by Old McDonald's farm. See? Diggly and CJ are filling the pit with fresh concrete. Cool. What is it, Diggly? Oh no! The barn is on fire! Oh phew! Here comes Ashley the fire truck! Wait! Ashley! Look out! The concrete is still wet! Oh no! Ashley's got stuck in the concrete! How will we put the fire out now? Johnny and Dozer are trying to get Ashley out, but be careful guys, you'll get stuck too! Oh no! The fire is still burning! What are we going to do? Wait a minute! I think Diggly has an idea! Wow! They're going to use all those pipes to form one long pipe! <laughs> then, they're going to point it at the barn! And then, go Ashley! The water is travelling all the way down the pipe! There! The fire is put out! Way to go, Diggly! Now Diggly is digging Ashley out of the concrete. Everything is safe and sound now. Good job, everyone! It's a winter's day at the construction HQ and all the crew are excited to get to work. Oh, today they're building a windmill! Hooray! But, oh dear. Those dark clouds don't look good. They'd better get to work fast. In no time at all, the windmill is almost finished. Now the sails are on too. Now to test it. But wait, it's snowing. It's snowing a lot. Oh dear, Mr. Rubble says they need to go inside or they'll catch colds. Diggly wants to play in the snow, but he has to go inside. Mm. The next morning, everyone is ready to get back to work. Oh look, there's so much snow outside. Oops, I don't think that'll work, Mr. Rubble. Diggly can dig a path through the snow. There, now they need to reach the windmill. Ooh. Almost there. There, but the button is frozen up. This looks like a job for Daisy. 
There, no problem. Whoa! The windmill is blowing all the snow away. Great work, everyone. Now they have time to play. They can all slide down the snow drifts. Hooray! It's Dozer, CJ and Diggly. Looks like they've just finished building a brand new house. Good work, guys. But something's not right. Something is still missing. Of course. They need to colour the house in with paints. And that big paint mixing machine. Red first. Diggly is off. He's mixing the paint in the mixer. Ah. CJ is collecting it in her drum. She's giving the red paint to Diggly. And bingo, the roof is red. Well done, guys. Next up is blue. We have to mix it up. CJ collects the paint, gives it to Diggly and... There we go, the windows are blue. Nice work, Diggly. Which colour next? Yellow. Uh-oh, Diggly accidentally knocked the green paint over. That's not good. Diggly's mixing the yellow paint. He's painting the door yellow, but I don't think he realises the green paint is spilled. Huh? All gone. How will they finish painting now? Wait a minute. When the blue and yellow paints mix, it makes green. So if they take the yellow and blue paint cans and put them both in the mixer, there, green paint. Nice work. Now you can finish painting the house. <laughs> there, green walls. The house is finished. Well done, Diggly Dozer and CJ. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ. All the vehicles are excited to get to work. I wonder what they're building today. Whoa, a pancake shop. Oh dear. Diggly doesn't look his usual happy self. I wonder what's wrong. Oh no, Diggly is sick. He can't work today. He'll have to stay home. <laughs> Time to start work. The first thing to do is dig the foundations. But without Diggly, mm -hmm. how will they dig? <laughs> That's not working at all. Daisy can't dig the way Diggly does. Maybe this bro will help. Oops! Mother's going everywhere and Daisy can't keep the drill still. This isn't working either. Oh dear, oh dear. Mm. Diggly is watching from HQ. He really wants to help, but he's still feeling sick. Here's Mrs Skip with some medicine. That should help. Back on the building site. They still haven't dug the foundations. Oh dear. Splat! Wait, this plank of wood throws dirt into the air, like a spade. Maybe they can use this to dig the foundations. Yes, it works! Good work, Daisy. She's found a way to dig in her own way, in no time at all. There, the pancake shack is finished. Aww, Daisy has brought some pancakes to Diggly to make him feel better. What a good friend. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> it's the construction crew. Hard at work as usual. Good work, Diggly and Johnny. Hmm, I wonder what's in that crate. Whoa, a yellow circle, a red triangle and a blue square. Oh. Diggly is right. The blue square will fit at the bottom of the tower. Go on, guys. Put it in place. 
Look out, Dozer. Oh, well, the square is in place at least. Here comes CJ. A little cement. And it's a door. I don't think Dozer liked being shut inside. Now the red triangle. Where does that belong? Aha! At the top of the flagpole. Go on, Diggly. Raise the flag. There. Well done, Diggly. Now just the yellow circle to go. I wonder where that goes. Oh, it's a clock. Which means it belongs at the very top of the clock tower. Somebody will have to go all the way up there. Be brave, Diggly. It's high up, but you can do it. Ready, everyone? Heave! Up and up we go. Don't look down, Diggly. Almost there. Keep pulling. There. Careful, Diggly. Just gently put the clock in place. Well done. You did it. What a brave little digger Diggly is. See you next time. It's Christmas time at Construction HQ and everyone is really excited. But first they have work to do. They need to build a present building machine. The presents go in here and come out here. But wait. They're building this for Santa? Diggly and Daisy are so excited, mm -hmm. they might even get to meet Santa. <laughs> wow, in no time at all, the present wrapping machine is almost finished. <laughs> now it's time to test it. Diggly pulls the lever. Oh. Mr Rubble puts the toy on the conveyor belt. Out it comes all wrapped up. Pop! Oops! Uh oh! Now the machine is running backwards. Oh dear, oh dear. Diggly's trying to turn the machine off. Oh no! Now it's running faster. It's sucking the toys up. Oh no! It sucks Mr. Robin up. Diggly and Daisy are trying to stop it. But they're not working together. Mr. Rubble's wrapped up like a present. But who's this? It's Santa. He can fix this mess. Santa snaps his fingers and... Phew, the machine is fixed. There's Mr. Rubble. He's still wrapped up. Phew, that's much better. Diggly and Daisy are sorry the machine went wrong. But it's okay. Santa knows just how to cheer them up. Whoa! A present eats for Diggly and Daisy. Amazing! <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone! Look! It's Diggly! I think he wants to lift that big girder. There's Johnny. He has no problem lifting heavy loads. He's tall and strong. But Diggly is only little. And that girder is very heavy. Oh, Diggly can't reach high enough. Poor Diggly. Here's Dozer. He wants to cheer Diggly up. Being big and strong isn't everything. Everybody has different things they're good at. There's no need to be upset. I think Diggly has a plan. He's got a barrel. And Dozer has a plank of wood. Now Diggly's up on the roof. Dozer's put a crate of bricks on the plank. Is it a seesaw? Oh, I see. It's a catapult. They can use it to bounce bricks up onto the roof. Very clever, Diggly. 
Johnny is still lifting the heavy bricks up onto the roof. But look, Diggly can bounce them up easily. He's using his brain to solve a problem. Look, now Daisy wants a turn. It's so much fun using Diggly's new invention. They'll have moved all the bricks in no time. Diggly may not be the strongest or the tallest, but he can be a very big help if he tries hard. Well done, Diggly!